Saturday. It's so nice out. Uh, right at seven o'clock, I just finished editing my video from the last two days. You guys are kind of blurry. Let me wipe that lens off a little bit. Um, it feels so good. You guys, I have struggled for so long to get caught up on videos and it's like, <sighs> finally feels good. Oh, I should show you guys the corn. Look at this. Like the corn is finally as tall as me. Like, look at this. <sighs> oh, of course, okay, here's the deal. This is the corn that was planted here at home. Is it going to make anything like normal silage corn? Obviously not due to the drought, but we have been blessed with some amazing rain this month. Like up until this last week, it has rained every day, like every day. And I'm just so thankful for that. So the corn is coming. We are mowing alfalfa today. It's Saturday. So I'm on chore duty for Carol. And then um, us girls are gonna go ride at the farm this morning. Jason's gonna mow alfalfa. I'm gonna try to snag some drone footage for you guys while we're like in the midst of everything. And then we have a wedding this afternoon. So pretty easy, lightweight day. I love this view. I love fall best of all. The only downside is it doesn't always get daylight as soon as I want it to be. Look at them go. They're so happy. So happy. Aren't you Roxy? <sighs> just a little bit or at least until Carol gets back later on this afternoon I don't show too much of the chickens just because it's they're not really my thing uh, but I hope on Saturdays as much as I can so. Jason's getting ready to head out are all fighting over the rangeland tub this morning. Come back with some fly spray later too. That won't be here when we come back. While I was waiting for Shiloh and Leo to get done eating, I had the drone in the truck, so I thought it'd be kind of cool 
to just fly over. Uh, when we've flown over the cows before, they did not really care for it. Um, so I'm just kind of getting them used to the drone sound. It just, they don't really like it near them. Like when I was hovering over, they were all happy, still content eating grass, but the closer I got and down further, then they just did not like it at all. You can kind of see the birds that come in and eat the flies. They're pretty cool to watch, swarming them. element so we got to ride this morning I've done all the chores um, Jason got the bottom the, the bottom alfalfa mode uh, he was doing that while we rode, and uh, now we are, I'm running back over there to pick him up, and then we'll go get beautified and cleaned up to go to the wedding, and then tomorrow we'll mow the rusty alfalfa, and I don't know if that'll bail or not, or if we'll be bailing Monday, Tuesday. Just kind of depends on how dry it gets, how hot it gets today, how much of it is humidity, how much dew's on tomorrow. There's a lot to play with with alfalfa. It's very rare that you can bail it for us the next day, unless it's dry, hot, grass. Grass sometimes does that, but a lot of times we need at least one day, sometimes two days going into fall. And even in the beginning of the year, you know, sometimes we need, may need good four days for that alfalfa to dry out. Just different times of the year require different things. So, and Buzz over here, pick him up. We had such a good girls ride today. It's actually the first time I've ever taken Jalen like on a true ride ride with us. Uh, I think she had fun. I threw my phone in the saddlebag, so I didn't really have a whole lot to like video. Like I just soaking up some friendship time and making memories and being more present. So that was one of my things I really wanted to strive on is be more present, especially when the kids are with us. So that's where we're at. Go get him and then go get beautiful. Nothing like wearing our best check cows, right? That's right. Looks like we're going to a rodeo. <laughs> I am not going to a rodeo in a dress. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, we gotta move the girls before we go uh, have a good time at the wedding reception, right? Oh. Hot. It is hot. It's 90 degrees outside, so we gotta move the oh, girls. Oh, so we're done with heat. No. One last spell. Oh, they're moving themselves. Oh my goodness. It's rough. Mm-hmm. Yep, I would. So I did catch some drone footage this morning just kind of showing you everything over here. Jason mowed that alfalfa down. We rode. You had a good time riding? Yeah. Yeah. And then we came cleaned up, didn't we? We went to the wedding. I don't have the proper footwear on to uh, walk across. Actually, they're Kaylee's shoes, so we definitely don't want to walk across the paddocks.
stuff he needs to do at the shop. My trailer um, that I haul with needs tires. Uh, he needs to unhook the Massey from the dump wagon from doing corn silage and get it on both bailers. Um, we do need to make a handful of large squares and then we also need to make little squares. So that's where we're at. We'll bail tomorrow. Hopefully the humidity doesn't play too bad with us. We are calling for some high heat this week, high indexes, back at the 104 again with humidity. So that's what we struggle with is uh, just having good dry down weather. But it feels definitely good to be back doing what we're good at, being in the hay fields. Um, I am in the John Deere 145 today and I can definitely tell a difference between running the Massey 5S 145 versus this one. Um, some of it's just the comfort of the cab. You're not overly sure about the bunny seat, are you today? Jalen definitely likes the Massey cab better. It's got a little bit more space, a little bit more room. It's definitely high class. Uh, we're missing her today, but not that this isn't a bad tractor. I don't want to ever sound like, you know, what we have is, you know, because we have good stuff. Don't get me wrong. But when you get used to the best and then uh, you go back to the regular, it's just different. I am going to try to get the drone up here in just a little bit. I just was trying to knock some of this out.
So the, the alfalfa is actually thick enough. It's actually trying to bog down the mower a little bit. I had to slow it down. Because it just, it was kind of fighting it. running really good until I lost the boat. Uh, Jason's gonna bring us over one. It's hot, uh, but it's very, very humid and sticky and just, but we're almost done, so close. 